Well, good morning. The time has arrived. We're going to reveal the soup that we started last night. And we're going to look at uh, the texture and how the vegetables all merge together. I know you're going to love it. This is a great recipe. I wanted to talk about a couple of things that uh, you can do to change it up a little bit. If you would like, you can make your own beans as we talked about yesterday. One of the things that I often do is I'll strain the beans. Uh, I'll use a colander or, or some type of strainer, rinse the beans, and then instead of using the bean juice, if you will, for the, the sauce of this soup, I will add water or vegetable broth. And it's really easy to do. Uh, it gives it a great flavor. I especially like the vegetable broth, but uh, it, it, it means that you can wash those beans and use the canned beans and get out uh, any extra salts or additives that may be in the beans. Another thing you can do is you can roast the corn. Uh, use your grill roast that corn, cut it off the cob, add that flavor, roast some peppers, poblano peppers, red and yellow bell peppers, and my favorite, jalapeno. You can add those to this and it makes a great flavor in this soup. But let's look at it and let's see how it goes. We'll pour up a bowl and uh, I'll let you know how it goes. So let's start by opening up the crock pot. I cooked this on high until about midnight, and then I turned it down to low, and this morning I turned it on warm. Stir it up here. Look at how the vegetables all merge together. You've got the black beans, the red beans, the potatoes, the carrots. It's just a great mixture. And here in just a minute, we'll add the cilantro. We'll give it a taste, and I know you're going to love it. All right, so you've seen what it looks like from the top. Let's pour up a bowl. This is going to be excellent for a cold morning like today. I'm not saying it's too cold, but this morning after I went to the gym, I came back and took a shower and I had a snow and sleet mix coming out of the shower head. Pretty cold. Get some of that juice. Then I sprinkle a little bit of cilantro on top. And I'll use this and I'll mix it in with the rest of the bowl. Get a big spoonful, a little bit of everything, tomatoes, potatoes, corn, beans. It's just fantastic. Mm. That is so good. I'm not even going to add any more cumin to it. I love this. This is so good. And I know you're going to like it too. Give it a try. Let me know what you think. Look at how great this looks. Potatoes, beans, corn, black beans, cilantro, tomatoes. Oh, getting a little steam on the camera. This is just so good. You know, you can serve this many different ways. You can pour it over some tortilla strips and add some avocado to it. You can use... Um, some of the vegan cheeses, if you're into that, I'm not a real big fan of the fake cheeses or the fake meats. Uh, it just doesn't do it for me, but uh, if you want to, you can pour it over rice. You can uh, add it to um, a salad and let it cool down a little bit. There's just so many things you can do with this. But my favorite is to eat it in a bowl with a spoon and to eat as much of it as I want. I really enjoy it and I know you will too. I got to have another bite before I stop. Mm. So good. Thank you for watching. This is Denny's Plant-Based Journey. Have a great day.